So, after I vanquished Captain America and Iron Man, I claim my prize. All six Infinity Stones. That's alligator for growling and saying liar at the same time. Well, at least my Nexus event wasn't eating the wrong neighbor's cat. Tell them your story, Loki. Me? Nobody wants to hear about that. I, I would, actually. I, it's just, I, I've been wondering, because I'm... Well, we're supposed to die, right? Thanos kills us after Ragnarok. Thanos. In my timeline, everything proceeded correctly my entire life until Thanos attacked our ship. So you, you didn't try to stab him? Uh, certainly not. I take no offense, my friends, but blades are worthless in the face of a Loki sorcery. They stunt a uh, magical potential. But they look awesome. Oh, yes. Especially when they clatter to the ground just before your neck is snapped. I cast a projection of myself so real, even the mad Titan believed it, then hid as inanimate debris. After I faked my death, I simply drifted in space, away from Thor, away from everything. I thought about the universe and my place in it, and it occurred to me that everywhere I went, only pain followed. So I removed myself from the equation landed on a remote planet and stayed there in isolation, in solitude, for a long, long time. How did the TVA find you? I got lonely. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I missed my brother, and I wondered if he missed me, if anybody else did. But as soon as I took my first steps to getting off the planet, the TVA arrived. Because we, my friends, have but one part to play. The God of Outcasts. Nothing more. The God of Outcasts. <laughs>